Hey man, what to do, man? It's your boy K for the win, and I'm back again with another video, man. Today we got the Indiana Pacers versus Charlotte Hornets, bro. Indiana Pacers on one side. Uh, good news on Karis LeVert, man. It was uh the the mass or you know the cancer that was on Karis LeVert's kidney was successfully removed through surgery. Um, and he is expected to make a hundred percent recovery, bro. So let's go to clap it up for that, man. Shout out to Karis LeVert, man. He was definitely hooping, and he is on the road to being what I believe he could possibly be an All Star. You know what I'm saying? Especially in this position now with the Pacers, where he will be a starter. Clearly, the Pacers wanted him to be on that team. You know what I'm saying? So they do see something in him as well, too. So that can only do that can't do anything but help his confidence. And uh, hopefully he, you know, just fits in good with that system. So we got the Pacers. Then on the other side, we have the Hornets, bro, um, who's been going through a little bit of drama, a little tad bit of drama, you know what I'm saying, in the media, revol revolving around uh, uh, LaMelo Ball and uh, Borrego. I think that's the coach's name, James Borrego or something like that. Uh, Borrego, you know what I'm saying, kind of sticking to his not starting LaMelo. A lot of people don't really understand it at this point. Um, it's been a while in. Devontae Graham is not doing the best ever. Uh, LaMelo Ball is who y'all drafted with the number two overall pick. Um, I don't think you draft number two uh, a player at number two to sit him on the bench, especially when the starter isn't doing well anyway. Uh, but, uh, hey, you know, he had a couple points, man. A little bit too many turnovers right there for, for LaMelo so far. Also, uh... You know what I'm saying? Not not the best defense being played ever. But at the same time, bro, you know, with more minutes, more time, you're not really giving them a lot of time to develop as well, too. You're trying to stick a rookie in there and make him a, a veteran, you know what I'm saying? So how long drains Borrego last as the head coach of Charlotte Hornets is something to be seen. I'll put it like that. Anyway, man, finna get up. Uh, uh, I said finna get up out of here. Finna get straight into it, bro. Make sure you're going to like, comment, and subscribe. Appreciate y'all for watching, man. Let's get into the video. Turner finds himself on Graham. Shout out to Miles Turner, Malcolm Brogdon. Devonte straight on look. Oh. Get over the Sabonis, Jamie Lamb Pages over there too. Leaves for the for Hornets. The shout out Terry Rozier. Gordon oh, Hayward is definitely oh, hooping. Nice Devontae's shot right there by Devonte Graham. Both two good teams, you know what I'm saying? Who wants next? Potential Malcolm playoff Brogdon matchup. Tipped it in with the left. Potential. I don't know where Charlotte is. It is in the standings. We'll check that after this game. Nice pass out by Sabonis. I thought that was going to be a pass to Miles Turner, but that was a good pass. Terry Rozier, who was asked, it was absolutely been hooping this year, bro. Shout out to Terry Rozier. Off the window, rebounded by Sabonis. Nice. Nice turnaround by Indiana. Yeah, they've hit four threes. Three from that identical spot. Good take right there by LaMelo Ball. LaMelo Ball. That snaps it. Sabonis, there was some question as to whether he'd be able to play dealing with a knee injury that limited him on Monday. I know the Mac I know every day the Bucks regret not giving Malcolm Brogdon enough money, bro. I think it, they lost him in free agency, right? They ain't lose him. They ain't trade him. They lost him in free agency. I know they regret. Regret that every day. Got his own miss. Nice. Leaves it Look for at the hustle, the talent. Malcolm Bragdon amongst players that are very underrated. Nice pass by Sabonis. Sabonis, another player that's very underrated. You don't really hear nothing about him in the media, but he is a hooper. I'll give it to him. falls down, and Malik Monk is first up. McDermott, oh, blocked away. Miles got it. Here come the Hornets. They've got numbers. Nice pass. Nice pass, nice finish. Hornets only got 19 points, man. You know what I'm saying? Malik. Nice shot right there by Malik. Malik taps it over to Bridges, and here's Hayward. Gordon from the free throw line. Hornets look like they about to get it going, bro. Let's see what happens. I gotta put uh respect on Hayward's name too, bro. Cause I said he wasn't worth the money. He's actually been open. I think he averages like twenty something, twenty something this year. That's worth the hundred. I ain't gonna lie. You ain't gonna get a lot of people that average twenty points. So, you know what I'm saying? That's worth the hundred. 
And a lot of players that average 20 points going to charge you about, about 200. You see Rudy, Go Rudy Gobert got 200 for only 10 points. You know what I'm saying? It's not all about points, though. Nice. Tie game. Ooh, that was about to be a deep three. Nice pass. I, I just don't get it. I don't know if it's something's. I don't know what's up with the coach. Is he maybe just maybe coach getting in his feelings a little bit because he, you know, what I'm saying being criticized by the media so much that he wants to show you he's in charge, so he doesn't want to start Lamelo or. But that type of talent, bro, as a rookie, you don't. Why? Why were you? Why are you keeping him on the bench? It makes no sense, bro. It makes no sense. I say start him and Terry Rozier, bro. Shout out to Devontae Graham, but. We're going to check his stats, bro, but I'm pretty sure he's he's not, he's way down from last year. Nice take. Okay, Cody Zeller. Last time out was Monday. They beat Toronto convincingly. Turnover. Off to the races. Rogier. Nice take right there. Score the goal and we're tied. Into the rim. I said, I say start LaMelo Bonteros here. Devontae, clean look. Nice shot right there. Devontae nice. Graham telling me to shut up, but hey. Overall. I think Lamelo helps your offense a little Sabonis bit more. wins the race down the floor. Missed to the uh, the health of the organization, yeah. so taking on a huge commitment. It's, it's a big commitment financially, and the players, coaches as well. Three point Bonus. right there by Sabonis. Nice shot. Miles Turner's open. Holiday. Holiday said, "I'm open too, though." Nice shot. This year's been super aggressive here this third quarter. Brogdon, two on one. Sabonis. Woo. <laughs> Devante, extra pass bridges, step back. Ooh, nice. He, oh. Hey, he mixed him. He mixed them up right there. Extra pass ah, bridges, mixed step them up. Back. Nice oh, shot, bro. Smile. Nice move. Go go, Bataze in the game for Indiana. Brogdon. Good oh. shot right there, Michael Brogdon. Clock down to one. Pass deflected. Bridges. Lamelo. Oh, yeah. Almost a buzzer beater right there. Into the corner, eight. I said corner. Into the quarter, 84 to 80. Nice shot. And one. Day off tomorrow, and then these two teams will meet again on this floor on Friday. Extra pass. Big Bad defense defense right there by 88. I don't even know his hand. name. Here come the Hornets. Lamelo streaking. Good pass. And one. Rogier is laying in the weeds. Cody with the left hand. Little jump hook right there. It's one of the best moves a big man should learn. You know what I'm saying? It's McDermott. Almost unguardable, ah. pretty much. All offensively. Mid ranger for Rozier. Mid range fadeaway. Tay Rozier has been hoping. Looks like the Pacers gonna win this game though, because the Pacers just oh my goodness, can't be stopped. You know what I'm saying? Offensively, but the defense ain't doing the best either though. But nice shot right there from mid range by Gordon Hayward. Sabonis, Woo. strong like bull. He Rocket said it was an offensive foul. Let's see. Let's see. Was that an offensive foul? I don't know. I feel like. Sabonis. Ah, uh, nah. He had both hands up. He had both hands up. It was a little. It was a little bit of an offensive foul. I ain't gonna count. But, you know what I'm saying? They ain't call it. So they keep playing. Nice shot right there by Michael Brown. 10 point game. Like I said, bro, the, they, the, the Pacers just. Right now, they're pulling away. McDermott. What a fight. Nice find. job. McConnell. Now there's the assist. Nice. Oh, they're even talking about you. Hear that? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh man. Yeah. This time did not go with Oladipo down to Houston. I don't think he's going anywhere. Uh -uh. Terry Rozier. Miles Turner. Flips Splash. Ball, nice shot. Wow. Ooh, Doug McDermott wide open. He's still open. McDermott. Terrible defense, bro. Points. 
terrible defense. One, two, three, four. He was open for four seconds, bro. Nobody on him. 28 points by Doug McDermott. Hold on, let's look at the stats. Let's look at the stats. Look at the stats. Where am I? Okay, bro. Oh, wrong thing. If you know, you know what that was. <laughs> oh, man. Uh. Let's see, what, what game was that again? I'm tripping, I forgot already. All right, Pacers, uh, Sabonis, 22 points. Justin Holiday with 19. What's Sabonis averaging this year? Um, Who else hooped? Brogdon had 25, and then Doug McDermott went 12. For, he, they let him shoot 22 shots? Let's see what Doug McDermott averages. They cool with him shooting 22 shots. I mean, he made 28 points, so hey. Then let's go to their side. We're going to check Devontae Graham's stats. You know what I'm saying? Terry Rozier at 20. Devontae Graham 16. LaMelo Ball at 8. 5 assists. Miles Bridges had 11. Um, 18 points for P.J. Washington. You know what I'm saying? Not a, not a good game offensively from nobody. 8, eight, eight, uh, eight for 18. 4 for 11. LaMelo only shot. For, one thing, too, I, got, I need more. And then he only got 21 minutes, bro. It's like... How is he going to develop in 21 minutes, bro? Who is this coach? Come on, man. These dudes ain't even hooping. Look. Well, Devontae Graham actually won. But let's say this game, for example, Terry Rozier. Dang, he was down 30 miles bridges was. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Let's see. Devontae uh, Sabonis is averaging 20 points. Nice. 12 points per game is Doug McDermott. Uh, is that up? It's up a little bit. This one says 13. I don't, I guess I don't know what it is. Let's see. Devontae Graham still at that 13. I mean, he, he's picking it up a little bit of late. You know what I'm saying? But it's still down, way down from last year. Um, Let's see. Oh, the last few games, he's definitely been picking it up. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Making a case, but it's still a lot of L's, you know what I'm saying? What is the uh standings? Where are they at in the standings now? Okay, they are now out of it. All right, they 7 or 10. Oh, well, it's not that bad. They only really one game back, one, two games back. Um, But, hey, I don't know, man. Anyway, man, I'm finna get up out of here, man. Make sure you go to like and subscribe. Appreciate y'all for watching, bro. That was the Indiana Pacers versus... Uh, Charlotte Hornets, what y'all think about this whole LaMelo situation? Should he start? Should he not? Once again, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Karis LeVert for getting through that. You know what I'm saying? And, hey man, just make sure you stay tuned. Finna drop a couple more videos tonight. Peace.